and the wives. There will be lines for men and lines for women. And that's why you will not find this hole in all mosques. So in, in, in mosques where they don't have this hole, women pray in the back and men pray in the, in the front. How many mosques have we got in Ireland, in all of Ireland? We have 52 mosques. 52 mosques in Ireland. How many Muslims are there in Ireland? 65,000 Muslims in Ireland. 65,000 Muslims in, in Ireland, right? Okay. <laughs> what does the word Islam mean? You want to tell me what does Islam mean? What does Islam mean? Peace. What does Islam mean? Yes. We used to talk in, I listened to what Islam it means. To live your life according to the divine revelation. When it is when you have Do you know when the divine revelation first came to the Prophet Muhammad? Where was he? Where was he? He was a king. Yes, what's the name of that cave? It is called the cave of Hira. The cave of Hira. Yes. You know the Prophet Muhammad he used to go to this cave every year to spend one full month worshipping Allah. And when the Prophet was 40 years old, the angel Gabriel appeared for him for the first time and we will listen to you. Come him here. the divine revelation. Right? Okay. Well, we are the followers of all the Prophet Muhammad. We believe in all the prophets. We believe the Prophet Muhammad is the prophet. Right? Now, the Prophet Muhammad, when he moved from Mecca to Medina, the first thing to do was to build a mosque. Yeah? Why do you think we Muslims need mosque? Is it only a place of worship or is it more than this? What are the mosques for? The mosques are not only a place of worship, but it's a place where you can see your brothers and sisters. It's a place where you can discuss things. It's a place where Muslims get to know each other. Right? Well, how important is it to go to the mosque? Is it important to go to the mosque? Why? Why is it important? Why is it important to go to the mosque? Yes. Well, it is important to go to the mosque because, yeah, but also because every step you take, when you move the right leg forward, Allah will give you a good deal. And when you move the left leg forward, Allah will remove one of your sins. So if you walk to the mosque, ten steps, five times a day, so how many good deeds have you got and how many bad deeds have been removed of yours? And if this is repeated seven times a day, a week, and if this is repeated 30 times a month, and if this is repeated 365 times a year, so how many good deeds have you got and how many bad deeds have been removed? See? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala gives us a lot of good deeds, yeah? But if you want to go to paradise, you'll have to go to mosques, yeah? And you'll have to go to do. Who makes the best 